Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Don. Uh, when I, first of all, I would like to say sorry and apologize when I uh, deliver my presentation. Maybe crazy with my poor English language. Don't worry about that. Uh, so, my presentation is uh, road safety for a student. So I have a lot of experience, especially driving experience in the United Kingdom, even my country. So I am very happy to explain about my presentation. First, you think that's the best thing. How many people do you think are involved in road crash every day in the UK? Do you have any idea about that? <laughs> you? No. Number of death? Nine. And do you have any idea about number of serious injuries including brain damage, limb loss? Twenty-five. No. I'm thinking about it being more, but then I think it's be less. I'm not sure. <laughs> That's eighty-nine. And also same number of flight injuries 673 so many of those kill and injuries are people your age road crash are the biggest killer of 15 to 24 years old how safe do you feel in cars compared to other types of tra transport there are many pictures you can see 2.5 deaths per billion kilometer travel, 0 0.2 deaths per billion kilometer travels, 0 0.4 deaths per billion kilometer travels and this is less than 0 0.01 deaths per billion kilometer travel, also less than 0 0.01 deaths per billion kilometer travel and especially uh, 105 deaths per billion kilometer travel you are much more likely to die in a car on a motorbike than on trains, buses, planes or ferries. What type of driver do you think are most likely to crash and why? Here are some pictures, then you can get some ideas. Annual car driver fatalities. <coughs> this is my chart, I downloaded that. Young drivers, especially young male drivers are much more likely to kill themselves and other in road crash compared to older drivers. Here are some, especially for you, mm. <laughs> this one for us. <laughs> when influence the way young people drive, what are the consequences of dangerous driving? Do you have any idea about that? Yeah. Death. Yeah. Injuries. Very good. And summer. Higher insurance costs stay crash free and you will save hundreds. Fine 60 pounds for speeding up to 5,000 for dangerous driving. Unlimited for casing. Sorry. Always virus attack with my computer. Death by dangerous driving. This is my experience. Also, <laughs> I paid 60 pound, uh, pounds last week, even I lost, I saw, uh, you know, the Glindo, near the camera, near the Glindo University, when I chat with my wife, I didn't see that, <laughs> and that's effective for my pocket, unfortunately. <laughs> what are the con consequences of dangerous driving? You know, British license. Losing your license can have a big impact on your daily life. That is, you know, <laughs> that, that is very, sometimes very important for more than my wife. <laughs> because I am unable to do anything without my driving license here. Because I am an international student. Very important my driving license. Lots of jobs require a clean driving license. You know about that? Mm -hmm. 
money you spend on learning to drive and getting a car will be wasted. What are the consequences of dangerous driving? Mm. <laughs> Nobody likes to get this experience. Maximum sentence of dangerous driving equal two years. That's like a free holiday with free food and accommodation, <laughs> everything. <laughs> Maximum sentence for person death by dangerous driving equal 14 years. What are the worst possible consequences of dangerous driving? You can see some paper articles. Tenda in road. Death to you so someone else. When can you do? That is very important. What what can you do to be safe behind the wheel and see as a passenger? The big three, you know first. Never drink on drink or drugs. Sometimes I lose. Now I know what I do, especially in Great Britain. <laughs> mm. Another thing is also very important. Stay within the speed limits. Many people don't care about the speed limits, but they know some cameras not working, some cameras working, especially uh, residential person know which camera working, but always wish uh, we drive with speed limits. Always belt up, that is very common thing. Text to drive safely, sober up. Question, how much can you drink before you drive in this empire? Do you know about that? My course. Probably two points. Yeah, I think it's out. Two points? Yeah. Okay, we can see. Even half point affects your <laughs> reaction times. That's wrong. Mm. <laughs> yeah. The smart choice, you know. Don't drink anything before driving. Not a drop. Actually, that is a rule. But people don't care about that. The facts, how long different drinks stay in your system? Point of 5.5 percent beer equal 3 units equal 3 hours. 5.5 bottle equal 2 units equal 2 hours. Three, 35 milliliter measure split equal 1.5 units equal 1.5 hours. And you can see any other things because Add an hour to about times of alcohol absorption, the about times of approximate it can take much longer. You have also a choice. Count the hours from when you finish your, the last drink, no, when you be alcohol free and safe to drive. The facts. Do you know about that? Hmm. Not personally. Yeah. How different drugs impair your driving? Slow reaction, poor coordination, and any other things? Also, I have to say, never drive on drugs. If you take your drugs regularly, don't own a car, you could be impaired all the time. The drink drug drive, you have been in town drinking, your mate was meant to stay off the cozy and drive you all home. Your other mates are already waiting in the car, you are short on cash for the taxi. What do you do? If you are young with quick reaction, what's wrong with speeding? Always I have to ask question. Mm -hmm. Typical stopping distance. distance. 20 miles per hour, 12 meters or 3 car length. 30 miles per hour, 23 meters or 6 car length. 40 
mile per hour, 36 meters or 9 cars length, 50 mile per hour, 53 meters or 30 cars length, 60 mile per hour, 37 meters or 18 car length, 70 mile per hour, 96 meter or 24 car length. If you break the limit or drive too fast for the condition, you are talking chance on killing yourself or someone else. The facts. What are the survivor chance of pedestrian hit at 20 mile per hour, 30 mile per hour, 30 mile per, th sorry, 30, 5 mile per hour and 40 mile per hour. This is very important, these facts. Furthermore, 20 mile per hour equal 95 chance of survival, 30 mile per hour 80 chance of survival, and 35 for hour 50 percent chance of survival, and last 40 mile per hour 10 percent chance of survival. Now you know how to control your steering wheel. If you hit someone on foot or bicycle, your speed helps determine whether their lives or die. Also, choice slow down to 20 miles per around, especially even Glindo University schools and homes. The facts speed on rural roads. Drivers are most likely to kill themselves on rural roads, often by talking bad too fast or overtaking dangerously. Slow right down bends and in bad weather when it's snowing and winding. When is it to overtake? Only when you are 100% sure you can do so, so safely without speeding. Avoid overtaking unless essential. The facts, seat belts. Front seat belts save estimated 2,000 lives a year in the UK. In a 30 mile per hour crash, an unbelted back seat passenger will be thrown forward with the force of 30 to 60 times their body weight. This can kill the person set in front of them. You have also choice. Finally, make you pledge to drive safely. This is a special thing. All are up, belt up, slow up, back up, sob up, wise up, sharpen up, wake up, look up, move up, shut up, back up. There's a very special thing. Always we can see chatting with driving. Back up and check up. All are up. <laughs> so that's my conclusion. Uh, so finally I would like to say, uh, take care always and have a good journey. <laughs> That's all. Thank you very much indeed. <laughs> very good. Finally. Um, yes, that's driven home the point. <laughs> what did you think of that? <coughs> it's good because it made you realise like, for what's interesting when you did 35 